What's up everyone, in this video we will learn how to create a sign like this in Unity 3D. Well we won't be using Unity, we will be using a different software but I will show you how to do that for free and how to import into Unity and create a sign like this. Well I used Photoshop to add the text to the texture but we will be using a free software so the sign will not be exactly the same but it will be similar. So the first thing we will do is we will go to Google and uh, search for the keyword wood. Now why we are doing that? Because we need a wood sign so we need a wood texture. Now make sure you go to tools and click on creative common license. Now a few websites I know of are Pixabay, PX here and Wikipedia. I use I usually go with Pixabay if I find any because most of the images on Pixabay are free to use with no attribution. So I will click on free download and click on 1920 by 1280. You can choose any of those but I like to download in full HD. What I want you to do, if you have Photoshop then you can open in Photoshop and add the text and maybe some effects. But in this video I will use Canva. Well Canva is a free tool but you will have to sign up to use this service. Once you have signed up, click on create a design and choose your width and height. So I will go with 1920 by 1080. Once you're on this screen, click on Uploads and click on Upload Media and click on Device and upload the texture. Once it's uploaded, click on the texture to add to the canvas. We will move the texture so it can cover the whole canvas. Now we will go to the text section. Now here you can choose any of those. It stops with your imagination. So you can choose any of those but I will click on this blue wood because it says wood so as we are editing on wood then I'm gonna use this one. In here you can put anything you want I will create the exactly same text so shallow water. Now just to get the color what I will do I will click on this color and click on one of those and then click on the new color section and find the perfect color for our sign. So for example if I go with this one, this is a temporary color, so I will go to effects and click on one of those, I will click on this one. When you go to the color section and add any of the colors in document color section, it automatically adds in whole document. So I am using this color here, but if I go back to the color section, I will use white here and I will show you why. Because the if I reduce the thickness here, it will reduce the thickness of white which looks cool and I might get this one here as you can see this sign shows white borders white strokes so I want to make sure that it looks well not exactly but somehow the same well the colors don't look good but the purpose of the video was to show you how to create the sign not to make the sign look good so I will leave this as it is you can play with it and find the perfect colors for the texture then I will click on download button and the PNG will automatically be selected and then hit download. You can see here. And once we have this, we'll go to Unity. In here, we will import both the textures. So this one and this one. So next, we will create, we already have a plan. So I'll get rid of this one. It's from before. So next, we will go to 3D objects and create a cube. This cube will be our pillar. So what I will do, I will reduce the size of it to make it 0 0.35, 0 0.35 and maybe increase the height of this cube and then move this and then we will grab this texture and move to the cube. Next we will add a 3D plan. So 3D plan. I'm going to rotate this plan to minus 90 degrees move this change the size of the plan move this guy to here now we will just drag this guy and drop it to the plan well if the sign is upside down you can just rotate it if it's not then all good so we'll rotate it to 90 degrees here and you can see the sign looks fine and it's in the center yes it's in the center now there's a problem 
when I play and if I can read the sign shallow water do not dive do not enter or maybe do not jump but when you go to the backwards it disappears it is because the way unity works so we can't do anything about it unless there is an option and I don't know of so what we'll do we have a solution I will just duplicate this plan and on the back plan I will drag the normal texture and drop it to the back plan now what I want to do is I want to rotate this plan to this side so make it zero here and I can read the text which is good and now we have two plans but you can add an empty game object put both the plans and maybe the pillar as well in that empty game object now as you can see the those objects already come with the collider so looks good and that's how you create a sign in unity thanks very much for watching i hope the video helped please let me know what you think of this video in the comments down below and subscribe for more unity videos Thank you.